Hello and welcome to today's episode of Mail. Today is April 11th, 2024, and I've got three pieces of mail. One, two, three. So let's open them. This is nitrile gloves for when I'm looking at my cards, deciding which ones to send in to SGC to grade, looking for the best possible um, uh, quality of the cards. And I want to use these gloves so I don't get any smears on them. There was one card I was looking at the other day that had a little speck on it, and I tried to remove the speck by just like moving and uh, grazing my finger over the card, and it left this giant uh, oil uh, stain on it, uh, smear on it. I had to wash it. I had to, uh, to, to rub it off on my shirt really good. I was afraid I wasn't going to get it off. It was a really good card with a really good quality grade, uh, except for that, and I was afraid I, I ruined it. But um, now I'm going to use these gloves. Hopefully they fit. I'm going to use these gloves, and hopefully that will take care of that problem. There we go. I'm trying it on. Yeah, that's a good fit. It's a medium. I have kind of small hands. Uh, it's a good snug fit. I think I can, I think I can hold a card. Hold on. Yeah, I can hold a card. That's gonna be a good fit. This is a good purchase. Okay, great. Now I'm opening the second box. Okay, these are semi-rigid card holders for graded card submission. They're they're designed for graded card submission, and I'm I'm grading I'm su I'm submitting uh, cards for grading now, so I'll use them for this. If the cards are seventy five point or maybe a hundred point, they'll fit in these uh, submission uh, holders. If they're one hundred and thirty points or above, you're gonna need um, uh, top loaders like these, with uh, made for one hundred and thirty point or one hundred and eighty point. Now these are not made for one hundred and eighty point. I probably would use one hundred and eighty point top loaders for both 130 and 180 because if you put 130 point and 100 uh, 130 point and 130 point top loaders it's a really snug fit and I'm afraid they won't be able to get it out but they're professional so they probably would be able to get it out at SGC but I'm just worried so I'd probably put it in a 180 point uh, top loader but if it's a 100 point or 130 point card 100 point or 75 point card I'm going to put them in these semi-rigid card holders other than that I use these to protect my cards in general, even if I'm not uh, submitting them to the G SGC right away and in the immediate future, I put them in my um, filing cabinets and I, I, hold on, let me show you. Okay, I put them in here and I, I secure them in these uh, semi-rigid graded card submission holders. This is how I could keep my cards. I'm not going to submit all these. To submit all these cards would cost thousands of dollars. Um, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to keep them in here for right now and probably sell them as is without grading them. Um, but I'm keeping them in here in these semi-rigid card holders for protection. This is my supplies closet. Um, I've already got one box of these semi-rigid protectors. But I wanted another one just in case I ran out of... These. I probably shouldn't have gotten them. I probably should have waited until I ran out, but I don't like to wait till I run out. I like to have um, uh, supplies. Like For instance, I have about a thousand penny sleeves. I shouldn't have that many. I shouldn't have bought like maybe that many. Anyways. Okay, here's this last piece of mail. I know what it is. It's a 2017... Ronald Acuna Jr. Um, Bowman Chrome uh, serial numbered out of 99 green refractor. And uh, I got it for about $130. And I'm excited about it. It should be worth more than $130. I'm excited to get it and look at it and see if it uh, is a good quality card or if it's got scratches on it or something. Hold on one second. This letter came with it. It says, Hi, thank you for visiting us and making your... Uh, Purchase. We're glad that you found what you were looking for. It is our goal that you are always happy with what you bought from us. So please let us know if your buying experience was anything short of excellent. We look forward to seeing you again. Have a great day. Waku Waku Toys from Japan. This came from Japan. That's interesting how they do a business here in America from Japan. The, the shipping was like 20 bucks. 
Um, so that's that's in, that's interesting. Ta-da! There it is. It's sent in the um, one-touch uh, magnetic protector, which is a good sign because that means they care about the quality of the card. And maybe it's been in this protector the whole time, and maybe it's got uh, a good quality of card, good condition. I'm going to have to look at it more closely. But anyways, uh, I'm excited about this card. So that was mail for today. Thank you very much.